You got her involved just for that? in the red dress. Looks like we have the upper hand here. <laughs> you may be able to prolong your life, but it's not like you can escape your inevitable death, is it? You knew each other? More or less. Maybe it's about time you told me the reason why you're here. Maybe some other time. Enjoy the reunion with your old friend? As a matter of fact, I did. Wonderful. I wouldn't want my special guests on the island feeling unattended. Guess I'm supposed to thank you, right? Ah, I have an idea. Since you're here, why don't I introduce you to it? It should keep you busy. Can't remember the name, huh? A senior moment, perhaps. Oh, oh. <laughs> Enjoy the fun. I I'm a little surprised. Two times isn't too bad. I mean, it would have been better if I got it in one try, but I I'm not going to lament. I bet the speedrunners can get past it without even activating the cutscene. <laughs> You wish that. No, I'm pretty sure they can. Like, you, if, I've been watching a lot of speedruns. They do amazing shit. All right. Here's the other interesting part. This whole chapter is just kind of full of BS. It's Completely so... unresonant evil-like. Oh my god, what the fuck? Lasers. Why? Because oh my god. What? Lasers. Just Why do they move? Lasers. Why do they move? Because, uh, they, I don't know, security system. That was bullshit right there. There was no way Leon would have known that specific backflip would work. Oh, just wait, just wait. Oh, what the fuck? Just w BAM! Like a bomb! What?! Because, uh, Leon can improvise. What is this hallway? Oh, I, I, I like this part. I like this no, part. No, go back. Go back to the hallway. I want to see that hallway again. That hallway. Yeah, what about the it? Fuck. The fuck hallway. <laughs> you tell him, Alflame. You tell him. The f what? What? What kind of lasers were those? Were those alarm lasers, or no, were those, those like... were instant death kill you lasers. Were they? Man, Leon, you're you're a bit of a dick. <laughs> There's no time for resting, but I like the pose. Yeah, he strikes an entire pose. <laughs> it's just like evil ruler Leon. Mm, this feels good. He's just like feel the power of the evil. So that hallway is not as bad, but still raises almost as many questions as the statue. Oh yeah, totally. Like for example, it clearly only unlocks after it scans the entire hallway with the lasers, right? Something like that. And assuming that most people going through that hallway can't super ninja backflip. How are you supposed to get through that door? You're not. I, so I assume there's I assume there's like some sort of access to uh, get through it. Of course, 
Leon is a uh, Leon is a freaking superhuman, amazing secret agent guy. So of course he's gonna make it, no problem. Ah, oh, we no, got Louise's memo. Four. Oh my God, no! It's seven pages. I don't want to read any more creepy pasta. Oh, okay. All right. Well, uh, I guess I could try. Okay. I'll report my findings about the Plagas here. The Plagas have three distinct characteristics. One, as mentioned previously, the Plagas have the ability to manipulate the behavioral patterns of their host. Two, the Plagas are social organisms. By this, I mean that instead of living individually, they live in perfect social harmony. It is believed that they are a collective intelligence. It is believed that the Plagas do in fact support communism. <laughs> this type of behavior can be seen among insects such as bees and ants. However, this kind of social behavior is rarely seen among parasitic organisms. Perhaps it was a learned behavior by the Plagas. I'm finding out if this has any relationship with their first characteristic. 3. Pl the Plagas have exceptional adaptation skills. They are able to live off many kinds of organisms by creating a sim a, sim a symbiotic? What? Symbiotic. Come symbiotic. on. Symbiotic. Words, Gildam. Words. I I'm sorry. I, I have mispronunciation problems. Words, Gildam. By creating a symbiotic environment yeah. quickly, this ability, when combined with their social behaviors, allows them to interact intelligently between hosts, regardless of the host organism. I just... I'm not usually a grammar Nazi, and this is setting me off. It's it's cool. It's cool. We, no, we got we got two no. pages, Alphine. Two no. pages. Two. Pages. I am ashamed. Alphine, two pages. You know what, Alphine? Just just I am calm ashamed. down. I'm I'm reading the paragraph. Just calm down as I try to finish the paragraph. Just calm down, Alphine. Two pages. Just two pages. Two pages. Two, pages. two, pages. two, pages. two freaking pages. <laughs> I'm ashamed to admit that my I just pure... did this. <laughs> I'm ashamed to admit that my pure fascination with the Plagas in hindsight is blind to me to the true research objectives of the lesson I noticed. <laughs> Even with the knowledge that Sadler was going to abuse the research of these experiments, I could not pull myself away from my research. As, as, as a result, I am just as responsible for this whole mess as he is. I see now that I was wrong, but can I stop their evil plans alone? Ellipses question mark. Apparently not, because he's dead. I can tell because he left a memo. Which is kind of random. Why, why, why here? Oh man, dude, it's just... Mm. Random moaning. I think it was more of man. Shoot him. Welcome whenever you leave, whenever you leave, just shoot him. No. I'm. If I ever let's play this game, I'm doing that. Okay. I will never plan to go back to an area I've already been to, and thus I will shoot him whenever. Need money. You don't. You're good. I need so much money. How desperately do you need money? So I can upgrade my broken butterfly. You already can shoot things. Oh, trust me, you want to upgrade the broken you butterfly. You already have a pew pew. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Alflame. I do have a pew pew. Was Killer7 Capcom? Yeah. Was it? Yeah. 